in our school, students may accidentally stain their lab coats with chemicals. Now we have two chemicals here, okay? One is potassium permanganate. This is purple in color and it's water soluble. And here, this is an iodine solution. We use this for our starch test and also to stain our specimen under the microscope. Now what we have here is a potassium permanganate. Now we're going to stain it on the clothing. Okay, now we can clearly see that the solution has stained the clothing. Okay, now as I said before, this solution is a water-soluble uh, chemical. Now we are going to try to use water to wash away the stain. Now, as you can see, the water has clearly dissolved all the compound. Now for this chemical, uh, this is an aldine solution, okay. Now we're going to try to uh, stain the clothing with aldine solution. Okay, now we can clearly see a dark brown stain on the clothes, okay. Now we'll try to use water to try to wash it away. Now, as we can see, water can't dissolve away some chemicals like algae solution. Now, what's happening here that is the algae solution has stuck strongly to its fibers in your clothes. And now we're going to use a special treatment to clean away the stain. Now we're going to use this sodium thiosulfate. It's a chemical for oxidizing. Now as you can see, this solution can clear away the stain. Now what's happening here is that the chemical sodium sulfate reacts with the algae solution. This causes the product to become colorless and it's water insoluble. So it can be washed away by water.